Hello YouTube fam, what's popping? Hope y'all are doing great. Well it's Royal Guard again with another banger. So if it's your first time here, make sure you hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications. Shocking. King Charles and Shock Harry's paternity test results found in Diana's diary. Prince Harry's paternity test results, reportedly discovered in Princess Diana's private diary, have shocked both royal circles and the public. The claim suggests that King Charles, long believed to be Harry's biological father, may not actually be related to him by blood. While Buckingham Palace has not commented on the issue, the alleged discovery has sparked speculation and debate, reshaping views of the royal family and raising questions about lineage and the legitimacy of the monarchy. Rumors about Prince Harry's parentage have circulated for years, fueled by tabloid stories about his appearance differing from that of his father and brother. The alleged revelation in Princess Diana's diary, if confirmed, would significantly change the story of Harry's parentage and his position within the royal family. Despite not directly addressing the rumors, Harry's actions in recent years, including his decision to leave the royal family, have led many to question his true father. On a significant date, the Duchess of Sussex unveiled a new project. Prince Harry's wife has launched a new lifestyle brand called American Riviera Orchard. For years ago, the couple made a freedom flight from Canada to Los Angeles in their documentary series Harry and Meghan, and the announcement coincided with an important date. On March 14, 2020, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, along with their son Prince Archie and Meghan's mother, Doria Ragland, flew from Vancouver Island to Los Angeles as they transitioned out of their senior royal roles in the UK. After relocating to California, the couple settled in Montecito. The town of Santa Barbara, where they now live, is known as the American Riviera for its warm climate, lush landscapes, and vibrant food and wine scene. The name American Riviera Orchard seems to be a nod to this. The website features a waitlist to receive updates on products and availability, promising a similar experience to the TIG, Megan's lifestyle blog. The first Instagram story showcases Megan gathering flowers and cooking in a kitchen while listening to Nancy Wilson's music. 